Hello, today we're going to talk about running Xerox's digital magnet media through their iGen 4. Xerox offers uh, this in a 12 by 18 inch format. That's a 17 point caliper, that's an overall thickness, and also with three face stocks. One is a gloss paper, one's a matte paper, and one's a polypropylene. Uh, these are unmagnetized sheets, and today we're going to show you how easy it is to run through, through an iGen 4. Once you receive your shipment from Xerox, uh, you can open up the package, you'll find 50 12 by 18 inch sheets as well as the media guide. We've got the, the feeder loaded up, we've got some nice files loaded up that we're going to print. And we're going to show you how easy it is to print on flexible magnet through an iGen 4. We just finished printing up these three files on our iGen 4 using our magnetic sheeting from Xerox. Uh, we printed these two on the paper face stock. One's a matte, one's a gloss. They're great for use of uh, business cards, uh, save a date, coupons, uh, and other such things. This one was printed on the polypropylene, and it's a high energy magnet. It's great for car signage, outdoor use. Um, yeah, it has very good weatherability as well. Magna Magnetics makes a wide range of magnetizers. Today we're going to magnetize Xerox's digital magnet sheet with a handheld magnetizer purchased from Magna Magnetics. We're going to flip the sheet over, use the magnetizer, and now we have a magnet. That's sweet. Using magnetic media from Xerox, you can easily print and make magnets on your iGen 4. Thanks for watching the video and have a great day.